Mike, I'm a senior in the PCM department. I'll be graduating this May, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about the Leica Viva GNSS system. Um, it's owned by, operated by the Purdue BCM department, and what I'm going to tell you about today is how to set up as a base station and a rover. So first, we're going to go over equipment setup. Um, what you need to set it up is you need both of both your uh, rovers. One, one act as your rover, one act as your base. This tribe rack, this mount right here for the rover. Um, this tripod right here, this two meter pole, and your CS10 controller. Um, going over them a little bit, all you need to do to set up your base station is find a good, clear, open area to set up your base. You want to try and set up a half hour to an hour beforehand so we get enough RTK corrections to get you good data. Um, what all you simply do is you level it just like you would a total station or an auto level, and you mount this on here. It locks in with this switch right here, and then you set your uh, base station right up here, and they're labeled on the bottom. Um, you can't see in this video, but right here it'll say base and rover. The Only the one that is labeled base can act as a base and a rover. They can both be used as a rover, but this one can only be the base due to a licensing issue. And it's very simple. You want to make sure you have batteries in it. And it's got two ports for batteries right here, and you can also hook up external power to it as well. Um, a few things about it. It actually has two radio antennas in it. Um, one is an actual radio antenna, which is this black ring right here, and then there's actually a CDMA antenna right here, which um, we don't have the equipment to use that, but in the future, if you, you can actually use a cell phone to receive RTK corrections through this. And this card right here is actually the radio card right here that makes it work as a radio antenna. And pretty much what you want to do is just turn this on, and you'll be ready to go. And now let me talk to you about the rover. Um, the rover is another very simple uh, tool. It sits right here on this two meter stick. When you're operating it, you'll just bring it up to its full height, like so. And this is two meters right here, because it's two meters from here to here. And that's what you'll operate off of. This is the exact same as this right here, um, except this one will be acting as your rover. And it's all controlled and operated by the CS10 controller, which they all use these. Leica batteries right here. Um, they're all the exact same for all the equipment in this, so you don't have to worry about switching batteries. And um, the CS10 controller sits on this mount right here, which makes it very easy to use in the field. Um, it's got one battery in the back, and that's pretty much all there is to setting up the equipment.